Xiaomi is planning to enter the Android Go space. Android Go, as you would already know, is a lighter version of Android developed by Google for smartphones running very low-end hardware. So we can expect Xiaomi to launch some very affordable smartphones in the coming days, very similar to phones like the Nokia One or the Samsung J2 Core. You're watching India Today Tech, I'm Rahul Sethi and let's take a look at the leaked photos, specifications and the expected pricing of these Xiaomi Redmi smartphones running Android Go. So as per the leaks, the smartphones will be called Redmi Go and will have a design very similar to the Redmi 3 or the Redmi 4 that we have seen in the past. They have very thick bezels at the front on the display. There is a single camera module at the top left corner at the back side and there is nothing else apart from that. You only see the Mi logo at the bottom. There is no fingerprint scanner and there is no dual camera setup to go with. It does appear to have the front camera earpiece and regular sensors and at the bottom you'll see the capacitive keys. But this leak by Twitter user Ishan Agarwal gives us a detailed look at the specifications of the Redmi Go phones. First and foremost, the phone has dual SIM with 4G support. There's dual microphone for noise cancellation. It has a 5-inch display with 720p or HD resolution and good level of brightness at 380 nits. The phone runs Android 8.1, of course the Android Go version. But if you take a look at the chipset, it's Snapdragon 425 with 1GB of RAM and 8GB of storage, which is also expandable up to 128GB. Next you see the camera at the back has 8 megapixel resolution and at the front has a 5 megapixel sensor. The battery is 3000 mAh charged with a 5W adapter. Now, the best thing that seems to be about the smartphone is that it runs pure Android Go software, very much like the Android One smartphones that Xiaomi launched in the form of Mi A1 or the Mi A2. This means that there is no skin, that is no MIUI running on top of the Android 8.1 Oreo Go edition. And if you talk about the pricing, the leak says it could be around 5,000 rupees. But there are many other speculations that say that it could go even lower. I mean, we have seen smartphones coming down in the range with features like drop style notch or dual rear cameras in under 10,000 rupees and this could be the market that Xiaomi is looking to tap in under 5,000 rupees and it could go as low as 3,000 or 3,500 rupees for the base variants. Of course the configuration is nothing great if you compare it with current generation smartphones but at this price point with Snapdragon 425, a phone running proper Android Go operating system and having proper 4G support, this could be very well termed as a geophone killer. Though with that kind of pricing and specifications, Redmi Go could very well take off as a new category of under 5000 budget segment smartphones that are worth using. Now if we talk about the launch of these Redmi Go smartphones, Xiaomi is expected to announce the Redmi Note 7 and the Note 7 Pro in March and that is when the Redmi Go smartphones are also be expected to going official. Redmi Note 7 and the Redmi Note 7 Pro have already been launched in China and given their price point and their head turning specifications that include a 48 megapixel rear camera. They appear to be quite a major disruptors in their respective price category and Xiaomi could be looking to go all in in the under 5000 category as well with the Redmi Go. Do let me know how eager you would be to get a smartphone under 5000 rupees with that kind of specifications. Also, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and share it with your friends. Subscribe to our channel to get latest videos on technology, smartphones and other gadgets like this. Thank you for watching.